Booklets, newspapers, and books scanned with a flatbed scanner will often have noisy edges and centers. This video will show how to clean unwanted graphics from a multi-page document as well as basic page splitting and de-skew. On your screen you see an old user handbook that has been scanned using a flatbed scanner. In previous videos we showed you guidelines, the stack image function, and other tools which we will use here to split, clean, and de-skew this document. If you haven't seen these videos, it is a good idea to look at them before watching this demonstration. Let's begin by selecting all pages in Composition View using Control A. We quickly stack all pages using the Stack Image function. This makes it easier to insert guidelines accurately. In this example, we first add guidelines to each side of the noisy center. Using the menu Edit Multi Page Erase and option Inside Guidelines, remove the center margin noise. Then, turn on the stack image again to verify the center noise is gone from all pages, which it is. Now it's time to clean the four remaining edges. The two existing guidelines are moved to the edges, and two additional guidelines are inserted at the top and bottom of the document by double-clicking the vertical ruler. Let's again use the menu, Edit, Multi-Page Erase, but this time we'll choose option Outside Guidelines. Since we don't need these guidelines anymore, right-click a guideline and choose Remove All Guidelines. The next logical step is to split all pages in the middle. We showed you this in an earlier video. As you can see in Composition View, we now have 10 pages instead of 5. Now that we have separate pages, we will use the automatic DSKU function to straighten all pages at once. To make the document extra nice, we can adjust the left and top margin so all pages line up perfectly. Again, we begin by inserting guidelines. The first guideline indicates the new top margin, the second one, the left margin. To adjust the margins according to new inserted guidelines, we use Image, Image Positioning. There are several options in the Positioning dialog, but since we have inserted two guidelines, PixEdit will default to the top and left margin adjustments. We can therefore simply click OK to adjust the margins. Our document is now ready for saving to, for example, a PDF or a TIFF format. You can also publish your document directly as an HTML web page by using File, Export to Web. What if you have many documents that need to be cleaned and corrected like we just did with this particular document? This entire session could have been recorded in a macro, then replayed whenever you need to do so on other documents like we showed you in an earlier video here at PixEdit.com.